A Toronto police officer is being accused of lying on the stand a day after she fought back tears while describing the death of her partner, Constable Jeffrey Northrup. Erica Natividad was in court as one of the trial's key witnesses came under scrutiny. Umar Zamir's defense pressing Officer Lisa Forbes on her recollection of the events of July 2021. On Thursday, the former partner of the slain Toronto police officer giving an emotional account of the events that led up to Jeffrey Northrup's death. Today, in his cost examination, Nader Hassan calling parts of her account an outright lie. Hassan calling into question why officers Forbes and Northrup made the decision to approach Zamir in an empty parking lot while Zamir's wife and child were inside the family's vehicle. Court heard that the officers were conducting a separate stabbing investigation that night. Forbes had been given a suspect description from the victim, which can be heard on police body camera video previously shown in court. Okay. So a male with a beard. Yeah. What color was his skin? Moments before approaching Zamir, Forbes testified that she had a brief conversation with officers in an unmarked and tinted police vehicle on the same parking level who said they would follow behind her. She said she told those officers that Zamir was similar to the suspect description and that they should go over and talk to them to see if they saw anything. Hassan continuing by challenging Forbes' description of the way the officers approached Zamir. Forbes saying she and Northrop walked over to the vehicle. Hassan calling that description an outright lie. You didn't walk over casually, you rushed over, he argued. From an officer safety level, that wouldn't have been an approach we would use, she countered. Hassan also challenging Forbes' recollection of the moment before Northrop was hit, showing security camera video obtained from the parking lot. Forbes testifying, there is a very distinct memory in my brain that replays far too often of Officer Northrop standing in front of that car with his arms raised. Hassan replying, ma'am, what I'm going to suggest to you is that the replay in your head is not consistent with the objective evidence. Zamir has pleaded not guilty to first-degree murder. The trial continues on Monday. For City News, I'm Erica Natividad.